John Magray, and we're tracking rain right now pushing into our whole area. Some spots have already seen <laughs> quite a bit. I'll show you in just a second. Now, but at least still seeing that rain. 57 degrees, there's a little bit of thunder here and there, uh, but for the most part, it is not as bad as it was earlier with the lightning. 60 degrees in Mason City, that rain continues. Where have we seen the most rain so far? Everywhere in the blue. So this is a good portion of Floyd County, uh, some parts of Worth. County, Winnebago County, most of Winnebago County, and some parts of Sierra Gorda County. These are all spots in the blue where we've seen over an inch. Just to give you an idea, there is a report from Floyd, which is just north of Charles City, of three and a half inches. Uh, so I wonder if I click it again, we'll get closer to that. I did check earlier, and we did. I did see that. That that that's probably about right. We're seeing other reports above two inches in parts of Worth County. There's spots in Mason City, which is seen over an inch and a good portion of uh, Winnebago County, like I said, is seen over an inch. Now this heavy soaking rain continues. We're seeing in Albert Lee, we're seeing in all the places I mentioned, it continues to push from west to east. Some scattered showers right now starting to take hold in Fillmore County. The heavier rain is just now moving into Austin and it's on the doorstep of Rochester. It's not in Rochester yet. It's, you know, Southern Rochester, a couple light drops. Nothing much super put together yet. Uh, probably moving into Rochester with the more heavy stuff, likely within another half an hour. Rest of the area will continue to see this heavy soaking rain for the next hour or two places along I-35. You'll likely have an, at least another hour with the soaking rain, so you can expect it probably you know, another inch in some spots. So we could start to see some ponding and maybe even minor street flooding. Something to be aware of if you are approaching a road that looks like it's just a small pond. It might be a whole lot deeper than that. These rain chances, though, are moving out by lunchtime, and then things are clearing up for the rest of the afternoon. Highs in the mid-70s with a little bit of sunshine, although the clouds will still hold on. A little bit warmer tomorrow with an evening chance moving in.